Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna figure this camera thing out. But uh, this bed here, we're gonna have Hernandez. Then over here, Virginia Red on the Beauregard. Okay? So all of those are good sweet potatoes that homestead a chick like. Okay? So that's what we got going on that bed. In the meantime, let's go just check on and see how other things are growing. We got okra. Okras are growing. You know, so I got some watermelon here in the back. They growing. Them collard greens are getting big back here. I slipped a couple cantaloupes in here. There go one. There go one. And, uh, what that third one? There go one. So, yeah, I slipped some cantaloupes back here. Got some lettuce growing around there. I always have kale as usual. Check out my broccoli. Check it out. Hello. Broccoli is doing great. Peppers, come on, Peppers. Show me what you're working with, Peppers. Come on. Move fly, uh -uh, I don't do flies with my dog on bell pepper now. Okay. See? Come on with it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, come on, bell peppers. Hello. And they are loaded. Y'all are loaded. Hello. Looking so good. Looking so forward to uh stir frying y'all look behind. With some garlic and stuff. Hey, come on, broccoli. All right, I like all right, broccoli. I like y'all now. Now that's all right. That's all right there. Okay. Still got garlic. So I went ahead and slipped the tomato. And I ain't gonna lie. Some things at the last minute I say, look, I ain't got time to be trying to see nothing else. So I did when I bought me a couple plants. They go a lemon boy tomato plant, my baby picked out. So look forward to them. I got one of those big old uh, eggplant because, like, look, I tried to grow some from seed, right? But well, I'm just like, look, that's moving a little bit too slow for me. Why is my, um, be the right way? <laughs> Did I turn my camera upside down? <laughs> But anyway, eggplant. I had a big old large eggplant. And so when I divided it, it was like literally four plants in one. Um, I did went out and got a yellow pepper. Because right now, I'm going to tell you all right now, it's ain't time to be trying to get nothing from seed. Like, you buy that stuff and throw it in the ground and call it a doggone day. Onions are still doing well. You want to see some missing spaces because I've actually harvested some. I harvested some onions already, so you're gonna see some missing spaces. I took like five of them in the house yesterday, <laughs> but uh, but they're doing well. They are doing well. The ones I picked yesterday were, they were a lot bigger, so I'm like, let me take y'all on in the house. All right, let's check out these tomatoes. Y'all bear with me. I'm going to figure out this little camera stuff, too. <laughs> Between camera and trying to upload stuff, i figure it out. Don't worry. I stuck some marigolds in here. Um, There go another eggplant. As you see here, my tomatoes are making tomatoes. Wait at that. I just say there you go. See, they're making tomatoes. They are making tomatoes. I'm going to hold you up so you can see good. Yeah, we're making tomatoes on here. There we go. And, of course, my hubby here. We're going to go ahead and string these tomatoes up today. 
So I'm gonna show you him doing that because I'm not holding up no. Now if it was like a stick or something, cause see I got those big heavy duty green stakes that you gotta take that little thingamajiggy -thingy and hit them things in the ground. So I'm gonna tell him to do it. <laughs> cause I, you know, I'm just not built for that. I can't lie to you, but they're gonna my tomatoes, they form and hey y'all. Oh, I look so good putting y'all on a nice sandwich. Look at my other tomatoes. So tomatoes are doing well. I stuck some mint over here too. In its own bucket, of course. You don't ever want to put mint directly up in the ground. Because it'll take over your whole yard. I got another bucket of mint right there. That's peppermint. I got another bucket of mint over there. Uh-uh. You can see the little green bucket. Uh, the reason why I did that because I have trouble with bugs like zucchini um, zucchini squash and cucumbers those things I ain't gonna lie to y'all I struggle with every year those bugs they just get me so that just don't always work out too good on this side I have squash 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 ooh corn I'm going to take off this little yellow leaf here. Of course, you see yellow leaf, y'all going to pull that off. It takes energy away from your plant. I don't know what that is. It was already there. It's kind of one of them things that was growing last minute. And also, I'll go ahead and tell you, the, 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 the squash and zucchini that I'm showing you right now. And I, I went also and picked up some bush cucumbers. That was another thing. Because I had such a late start in the season, I was like, and if I got time for that, I was like, look, let me just throw some stuff in the ground. Y'all catch up, lady. Y'all just catch up. That's actually, uh, is that a cucumber? I think that's my bush cucumber there. But anyway, that's a squash. Um, and yeah, everything down this line right here, I have my um, cucumbers. And these are bush type cucumbers. Oh, Lord, they go one of my kids. What you want, little boy? Cucumber. Mm, I'm smelling some. Y'all look how good my lettuce is doing too. My lettuce is doing fabulous. And I've already been picking off of it, but love you love lettuce, Daddy? Mm -hmm. This lettuce is doing fabulous. You've had lettuce. Cucumbers and ants. I'm gonna put some cayenne pepper on them dog on ants. And this is also another pepper I picked up as well. Let's see what kind of uh Yeah, I picked up a red pepper. So yeah, this is my zucchini on this side. Zucchini. Uh, I'll figure out what that is. <laughs> that's a zucchini there. Yes, zucchini. You like that's zucchini, Big Daddy? Uh huh. I saw the and that's zucchini Dan. right there. Well, you can dance that is good. You did? Uh huh. Your PJ's mixing that. That's the vegetables. Gabriel. Gabriel. Do you got on your little brother paint? Yeah. Gabriel. Huh? <laughs> you on camera? <laughs> These are my pants and they fit. Uh, okay, if you say so. I think them your brothers on though. <laughs> <laughs> yep. But anyway, that's what's going on for today. I don't know why my camera looking one way. Mama, holla at y'all later. <laughs> there we go. I'm just like, now I know I ain't that crazy. Now, what is going on with my dang on camera? I am sweating. Mm. I'm about to go hop in the shower because I've been out here in the morning. Oh, God. So, anyway, that's what's going on with my little garden. I'm just saying, y'all, I ain't feel right making contact because I couldn't figure out who I was looking at. That, that, that could be a problem for some people. So, anyway, as you can see, my lush is doing what it do. Gabriel come out here to grace us with his presence. <laughs> So, uh, uh, yeah, that's what's going on right now. It's nice and luscious out here, and I'm looking forward to some food. It's about to, with the times we end, y'all, I'll be up in the store. Them shelves be empty. I'm just like, oh, okay. Well, good thing I, I started something. So, the only thing I need to get me now, I need to go get me a canner. So, I'm going to do that the first of next month coming up in June. Probably the first week or two, I'm going to go ahead and get me a canner. And then I'm going to be watching y'all videos. Trying to figure out what to do because I am definitely going to can, can, can. Because I can't, if I can't even find things, something simple as topsoil and dirt and stuff, 
I don't like this is a problem, okay? Um, especially for people like me. <laughs> I'm probably a little behind. I, you know, I ain't I ain't in the OG league yet. I'm just kind of you know, I, I do enough where I got some food, but I'm definitely looking forward to all the bees. And I definitely tell anybody, plant lots of beans, plant lots of potatoes, plant lots of sweet potatoes. I ain't gonna lie, I don't eat all them beans. So maybe my family might like it, but that's a good thing to have if you're hungry. But I be tanning them sweet potatoes up. And y'all can even take them leaves off them sweet potatoes and saute, saute them bad boys with some garlic and some onion. Things I both have, that, that comes in handy. Uh, I'll tell you another thing. I ain't really even go over my trees with y'all. My trees, I think because they had the polyation issues, it did so bad. Them bees was not on their job. Or maybe the chemicals that's in the air. I don't know. I ain't put none in them. But there are less and less bees. I got to figure out ways to get bees to come up in my backyard. Close that door, boy. But I did... Um, I did when I bought a, some uh, some flowers and planted some seeds. Next year, definitely, though, I'm going to make sure I have a gang load of flowers. But in the meantime, be looking forward to eating on the food that I do have as far as, you know. Tomatoes, cucumbers, lettuce, zucchini, potatoes, beans, corns, peppers, you know, whatever. The stuff I, I'm i eating on that. So, you know, at least I got, you know, a good bit of food to sustain me. But like I said, that canning, that's going to have more of an effect on everything because it's one thing to grow food but now we got to figure out how to preserve this food so i have a lot to learn so i'm gonna get my little counter y'all bear with me. i'm gonna get my little counter and watch these videos hope i don't blow up nothing you know my stove is electric so hopefully uh you know i ain't gonna get nothing too heavy like i heard somebody say don't don't buy them too heavy don't get no one of them big 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 cans if you got electric that's what they say i don't know i don't know nothing about canning but i'm gonna figure it out oh they got a little bumblebee you should have been up in my garden as you just oh you come out to see these weeds though i ain't gonna go up to you though where you at bumblebee where that bumblebee i just seen him hey bumblebee there you go oh i see your little blacks here they that your little black yellows here now you up there he gone now i i, I probably won't go close to him <laughs> is the beat no the bee was out there they go right there in them weeds you don't know see him don't touch him though. He 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 fertilizing the weed. I need him for food. I'm gonna cut this grass in a minute. No, actually, I'm gonna make your daddy cut the grass. I ain't cutting no grass. He home now. See, when my dad my dad ain't home. My husband, I mean, when he ain't home, I gotta cut the grass. See, he a truck driver. Follow the wise, the guy truck drivers be like, whoo whoo whoo. <laughs> I can't wait. He behind. Come off the road though. We got all these kids. Uh uh. I need me a ride along. I ain't gonna be out here cutting the grass. Well, he home though. He cut it though. So he home today. Well, he came home yesterday. So I'm gonna tell him cut this grass today. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna get me a can of y'all. Cause like, listen, we we, we got to get this food game on lock. You know what I'm saying? Get this food game on lock. So we're growing food. We got food and whatnot. So uh, yeah, get this can of next. But anyway, just want to say hey to y'all. Oh let y'all know what's going on. Oh my my little update, as you see. I have a lot of progress, so yeah, that's it. I'm gonna get out the sun. I'm about to go hop my behind up in the shower, and uh, hopefully y'all taking showers too. And I'm gonna holler at y'all. Y'all have a lovely and blessed day. Thank you. Homestead of Chicks signing out. Bye.